go. This video is about how to insert fields into uh, Word documents. Fields are um, what you would use to insert a, a formula uh, in a Word document just like you would do in, in Excel or to insert a date or uh, similar um, actions. Um, in the AS level you will probably see it in in the merge uh, in the mailings um, in the emails and the labels um, to insert a, uh, a field you just have to go to the insert menu text options and there you would see something that says quick parts and on the quick parts you see field okay click on field and you can get the menu of all the options you'll see that there's loads of fields names okay uh, mo one of the most common is the date we will ser insert that one and you have um, a fairly large amount of formats that depends on the um, languages that you have uh, installed on, on your computer um, we can select this one over here and say okay and even though it seems that that date is uh, just fixed as you see if I put my uh, mouse over it it turns gray uh, that means every day it'll change. Uh, if that's not the format that you want to fill in, uh, you can right click on it and you can either edit the field and change the menu again. Or if you want something more complicated, you can toggle the field codes. You can do that with a right click toggle or you can click on uh, Shift F9 and you will see that uh, uh, if I click there and shift at 9 it changes shift and uh, F9 and I, here I see the the, the, the formula okay uh, and I can change the format of my um, date uh, depending on various codes which I will uh, upload uh, on the online Academy um, and then you just have to click update and that will change um, so, uh, for example, if we clicked on, um, if we clicked on here, um, click on OK, and we edited the field node, we changed the toggle field codes, we'll see that this state is like this, and we can even change it manually and then update and I can and that's the format changed okay obviously you can also insert any change uh, with the with the font and the paragraph options and then you would see it also in the code that's the date field it's very common various options that you have there um, another of the most common fields that you have to add is an if um, if condition so I'll go to insert uh, I'll go to quick parts field and you can see that you have here um, the if condition and as you see if expression one um, and the operator equals is different or whatever expression two, show this or show that okay um, one of the most common users is here is in the mail merge so I'll, I will show it to you there I'll go into the mail me into the mailings I will I'm going to start a new mail me new mailing with the wizard um, use an uh, existing list I'm going to write the letter um, let's see what list uh, we have here yeah test list that we have here write your letter um, I'm going to insert the title as space oh, we'll change that afterwards so I'm going to insert the first name and the last name okay close change that delete that put a space there and put a space there so that's a normal mailing merge codes um, now I'm going to do something with that so I'm going to insert um, I can do this two ways I'm going to put an if there and couldn't I can do it two ways an easy way is to use the rules rules if then else and I can say if 
title equals to Mr. Just say, for example, it's a boy. If not, if it's, it's a girl. So if I put that, and I'll just preview my letters, it's a girl if it's Mrs. It's a girl. And then it's a boy when it's Mr. So that's a, a easy way to do it using the, the, um, the wizard. I could also go um, and do it manually. I could um, I could insert um, I could insert here I could insert the title and uh, I could use um, I could also insert the um, field that we want an if field. Okay, I'll just leave it like that. If I change this and see the code, I could just go here and if title, if the title if the title equals Mr. Put boy. If not, it's a girl. So now I, I can change, go back to that. Yeah, correct that. way so I'm going to insert the if field I'm going to insert the if field sorry that and I'm going to say if it's the expression equals mister that's a boy it's a girl. So that inserts that. I'm going to show the code. That's the that's that. And where it says expression, I can just copy this. If uh, title equals that. So now if I preview the letters, I can say boy, girl, okay, so I could do it with a wizard or, or with, um, or manually. Remember that then you can always check the code that you have there, right click in edit fields or right click in double field codes, okay. So uh, right click, if you see right click edit field, this is a merge field. Um, with uh, that's called uh, last name okay so you can even do the merge fields manually add in the quick parts field go into the merge field select the format the field name and click on okay um, and that obviously you've got lots of options so just play around with the options and do the exercises on the online academy